clouds are formed or rain falls? This is all about water cycle. Let us explore. When the sun heats up the rivers, lakes and oceans, water changes into water vapor. This is called evaporation. This is the first step of water cycle. As the water vapor reaches up to the sky, this water vapor changes into tiny droplets of water. These tiny droplets of water together with various gases and dust particles together form clouds. This is called condensation. When these clouds become too heavy and cannot hold any more water, it burst open to give out rain. This is called precipitation. As it rains, water gets collected in rivers, lakes and oceans. Thus, water cycle is a continuous process of evaporation, condensation and precipitation. Let me tell you some facts about water cycle. Did you know that plants sweat? This is known as transpiration. That's why it rains more in places with more trees. Like hill stations and forests. Sometimes snow directly changes into water vapor without melting into water. This is called sublimation. It mostly happens in cold air countries.